Γεια σα, παιδιά. Λέγομαι Δημήτρη Μαραμινίδη και όπω βλέπετε πίσω μου έχουμε το ελληνικό screamer που. What? Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Uh, let me do this again. I'm sorry, just uh, Greek is. Uh... As you can see, you know, I'm Greek and I love to promote my country, Greece. Anyway, let's start this all over. My name is Dimitri Marmonides and thank you very much for visiting the uh, Epic website under the uh, Screamer product page, the Screamer Greek edition. As you can see behind me right here, we have the, um, the Greek edition, limited edition, tight, okay, with a Greek flag. Okay, so um, again, all my prototypes, all my prototypes are always with the Greek flag. Uh, it's all about Greece, okay? Uh, so I did get a lot of response. I get a lot of response from different people saying, especially Greeks, hey, I would like a Greek kite. Hey, I would like, Dimitri, can you make me so? I decided to uh, come up with a limited edition of Screamers, uh, but with the Greek flag. So it's just like, it's a Greek, uh, a Greek kite, okay? So, um, and those are limited edition, and we sell it to uh, the public. But a lot of people, you know, a lot of Greeks love to have the Greek edition kite. So again, if you're a Greek and would love to uh, promote your country, then invest on the Greek kite, the Screamer. Uh, or if you are just a normal customer uh, and you would like to, uh, you know, promote Greece. And uh, when you go to the islands in Greece, this is your passport. You know, they see you with a Greek kite, they're like, oh, he's Greek, of course, in the Hellenas. So uh, anyway, uh, let me talk to you more about the um, uh, screamers. The screamers uh, come, the Greek edition, are the same than the normal screamers that we have. Uh, they come in 7, 9, 12 and 14, but they look the way they are now, with the Greek flag, blue, uh, white and uh, you know, these beautiful colors of Greece. Um, and the performance is the same. So if you're a kite that likes to do uh, things way up there, like a big mega kite loops, uh, big boards up, big handle passes, you just like to go big than the screamers of the kite you want to get your hands on. And these particularly are the Screamer Greek Edition with the Greek flag. Uh, now, uh, these uh, screamers, Greek Edition, come just in a simple bag, as you can see here. Very nice bag, you know, waterproof, but there's no pump. Uh, nothing in okay, so just a strap and the kite okay very simple very easy okay, so this is a very nice kite uh, bag to have uh, Now let me talk to you more about the kite you can see the screamers have uh, five struts All around compared to the renegades and the surf kite and the junior pro kites and Also on the leading edge here you can see a very nice uh, reinforcement that protects the leading edge it's where the bridle is attached, and this is the EVA. And it's there on every attachment point. Also, this is uh, very nice. It protects the uh, strut and also helps relaunch. That's the reason why we have these tracks here. So it grabs the water and relaunch it. This is where you put uh, your, want, your pump and you can slide it to lock it. Or you can use also, if you use a fifth line bar, you can put your fifth line bar here. I don't believe in fifth lines. Uh, all our bars flies on four lines. So again, this is a very nice EVA protector for the leading edge. Let's talk about the different um, things that we have on the kite that makes this kite really nice. Uh, right now you're gonna see that we have uh, two types of valves. We have this valve and the other valve, the bigger valve. The reason we have these two, two valves are uh, very easy. One is um, the reason I use this traditional valve is in case, you know, I like to pump the kite really hard. So if you do a lot of tricks, learning a lot, or and you're crashing the kite uh, hard on the water, I don't want to explode. So this will release the pressure and it will open. So when you hit the water really hard, after a few times, this will pop up. Okay, um, you, so I don't need to lock it with a strap. I just leave it like that. Okay, uh, so this is one idea why I have this. The other idea is it has happened a few times. I go to the beach, I don't bring my pump, and I get to the beach to pump it, and then no one has this pump, and most of them has this type of pump. So I can still pump it. Okay, um, but again, uh, this uh, speed valve is very good because it inflates and deflates the kite really easy. So all you have to do is put it right here and inflate it or deflate it. Okay, you have a zipper here. To remove or change so in case something happens to the leading edge bladder uh, this is the um, one pump system you have some zip tie right here attached to here but if you want to lock it you just press this and that's locked okay this is the um, 
clamp inside, you want to unlock it, just push it up. Okay, you can see here uh, the strut has um, a very nice bench shape and that's for performance. And right here, you see the uh, strut, how it's cone shape. And the reason we do this is so we can have, uh, so we can keep the trailing edge really stiff. So it doesn't bend when you do those big mega kite loops, okay? So it keeps the uh, struts um, on the trailing edge really tight. See, it's very hard to bend. It will bend below, okay? But here the wind's pushing it, so it will never bend there. So that's one of the reasons, actually that's the reason why we have this uh, cone system on the screamers. You can see also here, we have a double um, material to stop uh, fluttering. And right here, uh, this uh, uh, prevents the bridles, see the bridles here, to get stuck. It won't stuck, okay? It won't get stuck. So this prevents to get stuck on the struts. And right here, uh, this is a very nice aspect is in case something happens you can grab it uh, let's say you uh, break down and you want to self-rescue this is how you grab it to uh, self-rescue yourself and drag to the beach so you grab this side and the other side right here okay so you grab those two uh, you can see the uh, reinforcements on the leading edge again the one pump system right here with the strut and the cone again the elastic that prevents uh, the bridles to get stuck on it. And at the end here, you can see we have uh, colors, we're car coordinates, so for cook proof. So uh, on the right side will be blue, and then on the left side is red. See right here, it's red, okay? Uh, the reason here we have one nut is uh, in case you want to trim your kite or you want to use another bar, you can make an extra nut below or above, okay? So it's one nut. Uh, now, if you want to attach your bar, um, the middle lines it's gray okay on all our bars so we have we call coordinate we have blue and red on left and, and right and the middle is gray and uh, you put it here this is the Rossman pulley very well made so we're using you know the best uh, quality on all our kites so again this is the screamer greek edition I like this guy. Ah. Yes, sir. <laughs> I told you.